Sweetie boy. Buzz kill. But, um... So, what are we gonna do? I mean... Highest... Not, so, um... Twigs, where'd you say... Where else did you say there were focuses of, like, ceiling magic? Uh, DM, do I need to roll a nature check again, or...? Fortunately, you do. Ah, crackers. But... If oh, you sit down... Yes! Yeah. <laughs> well yeah. You don't worry at all. You were saying? I was going to say that the tangle that was throwing your senses off is gone now that the portal is closed. So you still sent you sense much more clearly multiple points of magic. One to the south, one to the northeast, out out in the ocean, and there seems to be one that almost feels like it's moving around that around Oak Haven. That's an interesting one. Well, there's one in the northeast, one in the south, one in the ocean, and there's one that just seems to be moving. The other seems stationary, but this one is just flitting about. I can't really mm. pinpoint that one. Mm. My suggestion is we either keep moving south or head to the ocean. Uh, she looks over at the court, uh, or where, where where the quartet is. The quartet leaves? I, no. Oh, I, one of them is still over here laughing her butt off at what she did to her friend. <laughs> uh, she looks over. You did say Simon's boat was still here? Um, I don't know the coast. I don't know the coast saying that. Well, somebody said a boat was still here. I uh, would... Yeah. I said that there's some ships down in the harbor that could be fixed. Personally, I say we keep heading south. I don't want to waste time with fixing a boat. Um. That Personally, I'd problem. like to stay on solid ground. That may be a bit of a problem. Hmm? Going Only south? Yes. The reason I was still in Old Coast is because there have been bandit problems on the roads on the road home. My home is to the south. They have, the outpost has the road closed for now. So it may be a better idea for you to go elsewhere for the time being. Oh, very well. Heisen looks to the group. Well, then that leaves the northeast, the ocean, and the moving target. Which do you guys feel inclined to do? Raymond lifts up his uh, one of the, his legs and shows like his metal boot. I don't think I'm really much for swimming anywhere, so I think I think I'll take the northeast. She looks to the others. Any objections? None from me. They will none from me. If they are handling the boat, then we can handle our affairs here, and then I can, and then return and then sail off to Seamont. Very well. Uh, Phoenix, you might want to hurry back because you're about to run out of time with your intangibility. I know. Phoenix was just I was just waiting for a chance for Phoenix to pop his head out of the wall. Sup? Did, what did I miss? <laughs> <laughs> Ow, 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 ow. Hyacinth looks over at Phoenix. <laughs> We're heading toward the northeast, towards the ce- some one of the ceiling magics I'm sensing. Do you have any objections? None whatsoever. Very well. We shall and head he to the northeast. Up. Yeah, he steps out of the wall, finally. <laughs> um, somebody want to get somebody want to get sad fish? I would, but Rona's kind of coming up by the scrub of the neck right now. I'll go. Oh, Nick. I'll go. Fi- and Hyacinth is following. I'll let him know, too. Yeah, Phoenix just bangs there. on the door. Hey, her comment, Dodd. Wake up. It's, 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 like, si- it's like Simon Simon opens the Simon opens the door, and you see that his... 
you see that he's not wearing his bandana. His hair is... You see that his hair is wet. I'm, I'm sorry, what did you call... Sorry, what did you call me? Air Commandant. Why? Pause button. Was that Russian? <laughs> German. Oof. It is German. It is I knew that. German. I knew that. Okay. I don't know what because the language trust... sounds like. <clears throat> okay. Because I trust your judgment more than I trust most others, aside maybe from Hyacinth. <laughs> hmm. Well, uh, thank you. I, I appreciate that. <clears throat> You're welcome. So Simon, Simon re resets it, resets his bandana. I'm not going to ask why he's wet. I'm not going to ask why he's wet. I am not going to ask why he's wet. Dear God, Stogie, it is taking every ounce of restraint within my being. You <laughs> <laughs> know what you're doing, you little, you little gremlin. <laughs> <laughs> I mean. I'm kind of doing it on purpose right now. Okay, Hyacinth that's... looks down at Simon. There's an there's silly magic towards the south to the to the northeast, the south, the towards the ocean, and there's one that's moving. We were thinking of starting with the northeast. Do you have any objections? Um, he 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 looks at, he looks down down for a bit, and then and then he just shrugs. No objections. Very well then. We shall head to the northeast. Hmm. Ira looks up at Simon. Really gotta go so soon? Yeah, it's like Simon, Simon leans down. Unfortunately, we do. We have, uh... Here's something you need to understand about the world. If there's something wrong, those who have the ability to take action have the responsibility to take action. Mm. Can I come too? I want to help. You can help by mm. you can you can help by staying by staying and helping Iris with the boat. And then he mm. just and then he and then he just kind of reflexively covers his shin. Mm. I guess I do know. I guess I do know how to do how to do boats pretty well. All right, and it, it's, that's how that's how we, you you will help fix the thing that is wrong. Okay, Ira actually looks up at Simon for a moment, and then she like she latches onto him in a big hug. Yeah, Simon flinches for a little bit, but then just like get just just gently squeezes her and just and just kind kind of strokes her hair a little. Don't worry. I'm coming back. You better come back safe. Hmm. Hmm. I promise I will come back. And then he he holds up his he holds up his finger again. And she links her finger around the tip of his pinky. It's a promise. It's a promise. And then she leans over, gives you a kiss on the cheek, and scurries off, giggling. Hey, dude. Day's finally starting to come around. It's a Kodiak moment. Oh, my. Seems you're quite good at drawing in the ladies of my family. Yeah, yeah si Simon get just gives, like, a, si a side-eye to Iris. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that, then his, his lips are just kind of his lips are just kind of curled into a pout. Now she leans down and gets in his face. Is that an invitation, pretty boy? He reaches towards the door again. So, <laughs> Hyacinth, <laughs> Hyacinth grabs him by the scruff of the neck before he can go inside again and just like yanks him out of the doorway, looks him in the eye and goes, no, we are going. 
Raymond is watching all of this, and he's like, and he seriously couldn't tell she liked him? Wow. People say I, and people say I'm oblivious. I will call him a bonehead, but he's a fish head. Si <laughs> so, Simon, Simon just growls. Can we please leave now? Yeah. We should probably head out soon, dude. This one's teething. The sooner we go, the better. <laughs> oh, is that a call to help? He grabs Hoopla and and then pulls her off and then says, You're not supposed to do that. He can take it. Yeah, but that's not polite, though. He doesn't seem to mind. I assume he looks down at Iris and says, Keep practicing. You'll get it eventually. All right. You look, take care of the. What was that sound? <laughs> Doki sh shared an art. Thank you. Have it. <laughs> nice, nice one, Doggy. That is an angry fish boy. <laughs> that is disgruntled fish right there. Angry fish. Oh no, fish. Simon is very disgruntled right now. <laughs> <laughs> that is better than being depressed, though. He is a very Love emotional fish boy. <laughs> All right, you guys, you lot take care out there. Okay, so we're gonna go back to the map. I don't know why I brought you to this map. You're going straight north. Because it can bring the other... Wow, okay. Hang on, I can fix this. Hey, <laughs> Uh, uh, okay, there we go. Wow! I am on the ball today! Okay. Oh dear. So, you guys are headed back north. Do you all want to stop anywhere on the way? Like, you want to stop in Fake Do you want to stop at anywhere? Um, I believe we could we sh we could maybe make a stop at Fake Keep, you know, just keep the uh, ju just uh, give uh, give uh, wh uh, wh what's her name? Uh, Torin an uh, no, 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 what's her name? Dina. Uh, yeah, e Dina, an update. Okay, so yeah, but I am today. Uh. Where did I? I'm prepared. <laughs> uh, um, we should also there. probably get some chow for this one. Okay, yeah. So you guys head on into. If you're going straight to um, talk to Tina, I'm just going to hop y'all to um, the tavern. Mm. Oops. Mm. Okay. Um, so, the tavern's about as busy as it, ever, as it normally is. And Tina looks up when you walk in. Oh, I wasn't <laughs> expecting to see you all back so soon. Well, we weren't expecting to come back so soon. Um, so Simon uh, walks over and just kind of relays the general details of what happened to the South, and spies Pan immediately going to the kitchen and just continues talking. Right. <laughs> yeah, I mean... Really. <laughs> just let it happen, dude. <laughs> She's happy there. Let's not... Let's not it. <laughs> All right. Happy, so, happy just right, yeah, just recounts everything like uh, how yeah, it was the epicenter of a lot of the blast and a lot of citizens there currently are in recovery. Uh, oh my god. Yeah, just ba ba basically all that and how they're following up on a lead from Hyacinth about where they should go next. Oh, 
goodness. You're going northeast. Does that mean that you're headed for Ale Barrow? It's, it's like Simon raises a finger. Um, maybe? We're, we're quite new around here anyway, so... Oh. I think that, we could that's use some right, information. Okay. Um, Pan starts serving each and every one of you meals. Eat! <laughs> All right. <laughs> Learn my not lesson Matt, the hard way, dude. I'm sorry. eating. This is not, me, Nauschen. Not, not, Master, not Master Phoenix. Are you going to actually stay this time, or are you going to hide away again? Gee, thanks. I am going to hide. I just want to hear this first. Hmm. Well, the only... No, the only town that I can think of to the northeast is Ale Barrow. Hmm. Well, uh, <laughs> if you're going, if you're going there, I would like to ask a personal favor. Oh, sure. Could you check and see why at ale exports have all but stopped? I've actually kind of run out of ale. Oh. <laughs> you did what now? I am going to here. Bato just places a hand on the shoulder. Behind. We can get around in this. Uh, we, we can do it, man. We can get around this. It's that si Simon's eyes widen. Consider it done. I've seen I, I've seen that man three sheets to the wind. I do not want to see him withdrawals. You're you're out of ale? Is that what you're out of? You're out of ale? Is that what you're out of? Is that what you're out of? <laughs> uh, I'm afraid you drank the last of my supply. In that case, do that. I take full responsibility. As long as this one points to Simon, helps me he alleviates my jonesing. Well, Simon Simon's teeth are, are just jaws just clenched. <laughs> can, you can, can hear you... Raymond snickering on the other side of Hyacinth. <laughs> can we go one bloody hour? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Phoenix speaks out. Beat the mask on. No. <laughs> no one asked Tina, you! Tina looks across the um, bar at Simon. You're traveling with a group of Fae. What exactly did you expect? I have hope, alright? You're I'm naive. I'm all hope! You also had an awesome signature, but you gave that up! It's, uh, si Simon's, just, uh, Simon's just breathing heavily. All right, let's go to let let's go to the sit this city. See if it's on our way to where Hyacinth was pointing us. And all right, I'm just gonna stop talking before something else bad happens. Um, as you say that, you hear a shriek from one of the um bar go from one of the tavern goers. Did you really have to jinx it, Herr Commandant? Stop touching me! <laughs> what in the name of? Ah. Simon immediately ah. ru runs over, gra grabs, gra grabs, <laughs> no. grabs Hoopla by the neck. <laughs> it's a, I'm sorry. Uh, there's a. I, I'm sorry. My pet doesn't know how to behave. <laughs> they just. They just gra just grabs her and then just chucks her out of the out of the tavern. Oh, um, I will. I will uh, go out and try and find her. One moment. Oh. Ow. Uh, um. I was going to say it's a little bit far to Ale Barrow. At least two days. At least two days travel, so you might want to stay the night here. 
Yeah, it's not... Very well, if you insist. Uh, two days of no drink! Bummer, I'm dude. So I'm sorry. Ale Barrow is the primary export of ale in this time of year. Is room spinning for everyone else? It feels like it's spinning. Hyacinth walks over to Ronan, puts her hand on his shoulder, and just looks at him. You'll get through this, I promise. You've been through much worse. Yeah, but I'm Jonesin, brah! Jonesin! <laughs> well, just think, the sooner we go to bed, the sooner we can get up, and the sooner we get to Aleboro, and the sooner we figure out why the ale is not flowing, and the sooner you can have your ale fix. Don't give me hope, bruh. I'm just stating the facts. <laughs> In that case, I'm gonna need someone to knock me out. Hyacinth looks for a hot second and then shakes her head. Is like, no, I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Hyacinth looks over at Tina. The same rooms as usual. Of course. Feel free to make your way upstairs. Hyacinth picks up Ronan and is just like carrying her, carrying him under her arm, and is like, let's go to bed. <clears throat> Okay. So, <laughs> so if y'all want to do anything, <laughs> you're free to. Uh, Pan's just gonna make her use. I can't move. Again with this. Why? Game hates me, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fixing it. I'm fixing it. There you go. Okay, um, Pan's making her usual rounds to try to tuck people in bed. Except mm -hmm. oh. Phoenix, Phoenix locked the door. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not Master Ronan. Mm -hmm. If you keep pacing, you if you keep pacing, it's going to feel like longer until you get your drink. But I don't, <clears throat> but I don't got the sleepies in me, brah. The drinks, what? The drink was the best thing for the sleepy so. Trying to see if I can wear myself out. Should I send Hoopla in here? <clears throat> Probably. I could use a little dudette's ball of sunshineness. All right, one moment. <clears throat> Hoopla. Hmm. Ronan could use your um, brand of companionship. He seems quite agitated. As long as he doesn't ruin my jokes. Sad face is a sad butt. <laughs> uh, Hoopla walks around and paces around Ronan's feet. <clears throat> Are we dancing? No, dude. We are trying to wear me out. So I will finally go to sleep, please. Because the sooner I can be knocked out, the sooner I am reunited with the precious. <laughs> wow. Seriously, where do I know that from? <laughs> Maybe where are you out, though? Cut. Us. Exercising is very tiring, dude. Uh, Hoopla takes that as initiative and proceeds to wrap her tail around one of his horns and spins him around really hard. Do I need to roll something for that? Uh, uh what are you trying to do? Make him spin on his feet. <laughs> uh, um, roll, roll dexterity? Uh, <laughs> Actually, in, that ca yeah. in that case, do I roll anything? Dexterity save if you want to not do that. Oh, did that not do anything? Hello. Oh, there we there go. There it is. Okay, uh, do I roll no, anything? You rolled, a, you rolled a dexterity save. I wanted you to roll dexterity. Uh, uh, and Ronan rolled dexterity point, so save. 
Yeah, okay, it's the uh, same modifier, so I could still take I could still take that, but just I'll take the first one. What okay. I'm saying is not going through. Uh, Ronan, you roll a dexterity save. How do I roll a dexterity save? Okay, on your character sheet, do you see the um thing that says inspiration? <clears throat> inspiration, yes. Go down two boxes and your saving throws are in that box. Click on the one that says dexterity. Oh, oh wait, I see it. Yeah, um, try as you might. Ronan just keeps his hooves on the ground when you try to spin him. <clears throat> oh. Sorry, brah. I guess even your incredible insp- inspiring is incapable of making me spin. I had a song ready to go and everything. (laughs) (laughs) I almost wish I didn't rely on the stuff too much, but it is I am what I am, and what I am is really thirsty. Oh, I don't think I have anything to drink, and I was going to offer you some more. uh, I have a fruit tart. And some seed cakes and sweet rolls. Those are starting to get stale, so you better eat them soon. I'm yeah. tempted to do, but I cannot take a little do that sweet tarts. It wouldn't be kosher. They're about to go stale. In that case, sign me up for some staleness. <laughs> a hoopla hands him the last of her fruit tarts. Okay. Tell you what, Dudette, since you're a good sport, we shall split these. Okay, so, um, is anyone else going to do anything for the night? No, I think I'm good. Uh, nothing relating to other characters, so, no. Okay, so, um... I'm um, just. Are you staying the night in there, Hoopla? Looks like it. And yeah, for the record, the jo- the, the 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 song was gonna be "Grab Your Partner." Here we go, spinning around to and through. <laughs> uh, the our part is Ronan's gonna do a dance, so we don't make fun of Simon's pants. <laughs> 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 Oh, so it was going to be a humiliation duel. <laughs> I like how you think it is Darwinian. Excuse me. How about yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Feels good to do splitsies with, with a little doodad again. Can't remember the last time I have. I don't think I've ever seen you this serious before. It's kind of bumming me out. Yes, well, that's the pa- That's what happens when I don't get my. That's my nutritional. Oh, oh, delicious bubbliness. Uh, Hoopla sits on his lap. Is there a reason why you drink so much? <clears throat> Can't. What? Well, for me. Well, for me personally, it. It's the flavoring. But I really, the drinkiness is just a part of the Seder DNA. We really are the... <clears throat> we really are the OG party animals. <laughs> that sounds like fun. It hmm. was, Gdet. Till, till I had to go Splitsville. Oh, why's that? <clears throat> I don't, I'm not comfortable going into full details just yet, but let's just say something, something, what, something happened that really harshed the mellow of my peeps and my family, and so basically I'm kind of on my ownsies. Uh, yeah, Hoopa, Hoopa looks down, uh, I ref- I don't. How am I? How do I put this? Um, almost like in a, a sense of realization on something. Yeah, 
I know what that feels like. <clears throat> but hey, you still got hi hi. This is true. This is true. Hi hi's hi hi's practically been the family I wish I had. Along with along with you, little dudettes. <sighs> like her eyes dilate. <laughs> I'm like a family. <clears throat> Practically the only fa family I've got at the moment. The only family I kind of want, to be honest. Oh. Ooh. So. You know, you, you know what? That's you, okay. <laughs> so, you listen to my bumness. Anything you want to get off your chest, little dudette? I'm nope. all ears. I am perfectly fine in every single way. I got to Tanya, and I got Puck, and I got over. It's Oberon? Yes. Oberon. <laughs> I got Oberon, and I got you, and I got Bata, and I got Phoenix, I got, okay, maybe Sad Fish Boy, uh, and I got <laughs> <Pan>. <laughs> No, No, Hoopla's still salty with Simon right now. <laughs> hi, hi, you spud, too. I like to play with her hair. <laughs> <clears throat> so that makes two of us, dude. Though she doesn't really, though it's not really her st her thing. I learned that Nora's trying to make a hammock out of her arms. I learned that one too many times the hard way. A, a hoopla scratches her head like anxiously. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I get, I get what you mean. <laughs> Yet she still puts up with me. Yet she still took took it upon herself to take me, and so I'm pretty much invulnerable. <laughs> you two look like good friends. I'm glad to be friends with you two. And uh, and we're stoked to have you in you in the company, little dudette. <laughs> oh, excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, um, is that all? That's all I can think of off the top of my head. Yeah, Hoople just hops on to the foot of his bed to sleep near the corner. Aw, that's cute. Okay, so it is now the next morning. And no, you did not have a dream, Simon. Uh, where did I put this blasted? <sighs> I can never find anything. <laughs> oh, well. oh well. Um, so it's the next morning, and yeah, good enough. You all come downstairs for a quick breakfast. <sighs> all right. Wow, about the same. I can't roll as well as Kel can with uh, cooking utensils. <laughs> I was way too close to that train, sir. Just gonna over here. <laughs> okay, so um, Pan makes you all a quick breakfast, and um. Okay, Tina um comes over and she hands Simon a map. That's that Simon takes it and looks at it. Uh, she no, she's marked the path towards Air Ale Barrow. Oh. You have to go through Oak Haven Hills again, but you might have to go through Oak Haven Hills again. But at least this way, you won't get lost. Oh. Well, thank you very much, but, um, <laughs> Simon looks towards Bata. I don't think the hills are going to be too much of a problem. Oh, I doubt they would be now. <laughs> Big Strong is, like, just bobbing his head, like, yes, like, my goblins have got this. He's not saying that, but you can tell that's what he's thinking. <laughs> yes, actually, it's been really interesting. In the last couple of days... People who have come from Bellgate said that the goblins almost seem like they're integrating into the, into the town. 
I don't know, maybe the last maybe the last guy was just like a raider of some kind. I don't really do that. I do like having the epic battle, so that time I got to use it was great. Um <laughs> dropped in a hint. And he's doing some like finger gun thing like at mostly Simon and Hyacinth because they like to plan things and like remember I got got a goblin army, I like to use it. <laughs> well, if a time should come, at least if a time should come when you'll need the backup, at least you know you'll have it ready. Uh, I suggest you all get you all make your way towards Ale Barrow. Like I said, it will take you uh, it will take you two days <clears throat> to get there. Drink. Sooner we leave, the sooner we get we get your drink. Jake. <laughs> <laughs> picks him up again and holds her, him under her arm. I think I might have to carry this one. Uh, um, I mean, I enjoy a good bottle every so often, but damn, dude. I didn't know you were this dependent. It's in my DNA, dudes. It's true. I've met many a satyr, and... They're all heavy drinkers. It's like si Simon gives a big groan. I know how to fix this. All right. Where is it? Where is it? I take a I take a I take a mug of water and I flavor it to beer. Now it doesn't have it doesn't have any actual alcohol in it, but if you're just, but you but I you are very loud. <coughs> you did say you are a taste person, so if I give you this, will you have mercy? Who <laughs> <laughs> uh, actually goes red at that? that. How? Am I, what do you mean by mercy, dude? I'm saying the signature. Or should be your thing. Get on next to the fish ears. <clears throat> Did you Careful. hear everything last night? Careful, he bites. Literally. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna pet Hoopla just reassuringly. It's like it's okay if you wanted to do something. He probably would have done it by now. Yeah. All right, dude. I will lay off what should be. I will lay off the totally awesome signature if you give me some sustenance. <laughs> it's like si Simon get Simon hands him the mug and then he they just uh, set, they just heads out. It's like, all right, I'm heading out before I get a nosebleed. <laughs> glug glug glug. <laughs> now. No. For the record, it only tastes like alcohol. It's not actually yeah, alcohol. It, yeah, it is not actually alcohol. So, it's a placebo. Just, <laughs> I realized that for a second. like, <sighs> it's not the same. <laughs> I'm going to throw y'all over here. Because <laughs> holy crap. So, um. Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Oh, God. If the satyr doesn't shut up, I will shut him up myself. Just keep swimming. Just keep. Oh, I mean, um. <laughs> oh, is it? Have a now. No, wait, can I ask you for a personal favor? Please turn off obnoxious mode. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Phoenix is ha Phoenix is having urge to murder. <laughs> 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 So uh, Bato's curiously asking uh, Phoenix, um, is there like a chokehold where he can like sleep, but we won't kill him? Well, if you cut out the oxygen long enough, it'll make them faint. Are you, you know good what? at That's this? Actually, that is actually a good idea. Hold on, I'll hold him still. Oh my god! You're welcome. <laughs> okay, right. so... You're welcome, Phoenix. Ow. Thank you! Do you want to stop at the trade outpost? Yes. Ooh. I, I did. Oh, 
Hold on. Score one more for me. <laughs> oh, come on. I know I set up. Ellie, you're a champion. Yes, you are. Where is it? I know I made something. Uh, you know what? We're just gonna deal with the world map. Right. It's just a place to stop and shop anyway, so if y'all wanna, like... Excuse me. If y'all wanna hit any any shops or anything, the store menu is there. Um, I want to talk. I want to talk to the. Uh, I want. I want to talk to uh, whoever is uh, in charge of the general store. Um. Okay. The shop. You go to the owner of the general store, and you realize that it's the guy that you ran into at the Belfay Bridge. Oh. Uh. Hello, oh. I'm, in, I'm wanting to uh, purchase some things. Um, okay. What are you, what are you looking for? Um, uh, first, I would like to purchase a bucket. Um, hold on a second. <laughs> Too many things you keep track of. How do you do this? Um, okay, you want a bucket? You want a bucket of three copper? Uh, oh, that's good enough for me. Um, so we heard a rumor down the grapevine that uh, Ale Barrow is um hasn't been shipping out the well ale. Oh! Yeah, we're actually kind of... We've actually kind of run dry around here, too. Really? It's... Do you know why? Um... I haven't been up to... The, I haven't been up to Ale Barrow myself, but... I do... But I do know that there seem to be some guests in town, so... Maybe that has something to do with it? Hmm. Appreciate it. Thank you for, thank you for the info. I shall relay that. All right. Okay, so, so. so Simon goes back to the group and says that. All, all right. Apparently the guests over at Tail Barrow, mm. and that may or may not be related to uh, the problem. Hmm. What hmm. sort of guest do you suppose that do you suppose they have? It, he hit Simon just sighs. Given what we've been, gone up against, I do not think it's a good idea to guess about anything. Okay. Um, Ronan, roll a Constitution save for me. Oh yeah, sure. Hold on. <clears throat> Ooh. Uh-oh. Yeah, okay. Um You guys see Ronan actually wobble and oh. he, he and he topples over. Uh-oh. Ronan! <laughs> uh, okay, what do I roll to Can I roll to notice and try and catch? Um that would be the 30 save. Okay, dexterity. Oof. Can, uh, uh, wait. Uh, do wait I a minute. Roll? Wait, I got this. Can I roll uh, perception to see what's wrong with him? Okay. <laughs> I really <laughs> strongly believe in my ability. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. <laughs> what's, your, what's your strength modifier? Uh, three. That, you know what? That above the constitution. I'll allow it. 
you managed to catch mm-hmm. Rona just before no, just before he hits the ground. Roman! <laughs> is it perception or investigation to check to see what's wrong with him? It's medicine. Medicine. I got that too, so I'll do that. Ain't touching that little tip of the oh, 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 The last roll you did was a 20 as well. I think they sensed my rage and anguish from the last session. And they're like, you know what? We've had enough time effing with Katie. Let's let's Uh, give her a break. (laughs) This is your karma check. It is set to pay the debt. (laughs) (laughs) Okay, but... um, Am I floating? I feel like I'm floating. Okay. You're checking Ronan over, and he feels like he has a fever. This is not Everything's spinning, dudes. Out of character. Why the sad music as soon as we find out he has a fever? I'm just brought back to, like, Little House on the Prairie. Oh, no. Because I'm a manipulator of your emotions. Cry for me. Never! You Are we going to have to amputate my legs? <laughs> no. Um, he's got a fever, and knowing what you do about um, about humanoids and fat, you pinch the skin on the back of his hand, it goes down slowly, and you realize that it he, his body is responding the same way uh, humans would if they were severely dehydrated. Wow. Well. I guess the alcohol is more important to a satyr. I kept saying it's in my DNA, dudes. Okay, um, anyone who... Okay, anyone who wants to try to figure anything out, that's a knowledge nature... That's a, um, nature check. Uh, I will do a nature check. Do a nature check. Nope. Uh, except... Wait, I'm a negative one. Never mind. Well, you never know. Uh, do I Ah! get... Uh, Do I get... You All didn't right, have we... to put it on advantage, Josh, but, yeah. but you still net 20. Then. Yeah. Oops. But yeah, that's it. All right. So. Uh, I... <laughs> um, you're, now you're realizing every, every time that Ronan has said he needs a drink, that he needs alcohol, he has not been kidding. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. Hyacinth well, picks, um, tra- picks Ronan up and puts her puts him over her shoulder. We need to get to Ale Barrow now. All right. I'm flying. Is it- oh, rats, and I wanted I'm- to buy something. <clears throat> Wait a minute. I have an idea. What? All right. Um, <clears throat> this is something that uh, this is something that we did on long voyages. I can. I gotta. I gotta try and. I'm. Gonna, I gotta try and make rum. How? How? Rum? I, I, I need, what do you need? I, I need a pot, sugar, molasses, and water. Um, I, I, I have, um, 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 I have sweet rolls and seed cakes. It's not sugar, but there's sugar in them. We no, are I, I need, I need a trading a, post. We are in uh, a trade outpost. Yeah, Phoenix takes off and goes to, uh, he actually yells at Butter and Hoopla to come with me so they can... Kind of divide and conquer. Uh, right. Yeah, I'm, I'm riding on Bata anyway, so we. I also, I also need yeast. On it, uh, because Phoenix, Phoenix has a lot of gold, so he's like, just oh, it's in on my, on my tab. <laughs> uh, I want to help Ronin too. Yeah, uh, that's why Phoenix yell, yelled at Bata to divide and conquer, help, help get the things Simon just listed for us. What? She smacks his head. I forgot to list sugar because I'm smart. Cheapest mm-hmm. crow. Oh, okay. Then can I just say Bot, I got the sugar then? Hang uh, on a sec. No, I have head. the char- I have the thing. I just forgot to list it. Uh, Peter, basically you have Hoopla on your head right now, so Hoopla can tell you what you need, and Phoenix can get the other half of the things. Okay. So just Hi, tell me how Hoopla. much. <laughs> So, just tell me how much I need to take off my gold. Okay, run everything that you need by me again, and slower this time, please. <laughs> I have a hard time with spoken words. 
All right. I need sugar, molasses, yeast, uh, water, and a big pot. Okay. Water should be easy because... Well, I have a water skin. We have oh, alchemy Ray, jug. Uh, yeah, I was going to say, Raymond points to um, the alchemy jug. Eight gallons. Oh, we got those too. Eight, eight gallons. Don't need to worry about the water. All right. Okay. One gold <laughs> piece for the pot. I'm going to call it three copper for the sugar and one silver for the yeast. And for the molasses, molasses I'll call also one silver. Okay, I'm just gonna take uh, two gold, so it's all out of my pocket. Okay, that that should cover it. Okay, so add the necessary items to your inventory. Mm -hmm. uh, Bata gives one gold to Phoenix to say he helped out. Don't you worry, little guy. <laughs> I have more than enough gold on me. It's best if you don't know how I got it, but... Okay. Uh, um, uh... that's pretty awesome, but okay. <laughs> yeah, he just pat pats Bada on the head. Don't become like me. Let's put it okay. that way. Okay, so, um... To make this... I'm going to have... Ooh, Since like it's late hat. anyway. Since it's late anyway. Can't move. Ah! <laughs> it's <laughs> always <laughs> me. It's always me. <laughs> oh, hey, when, we get, uh, when did we get tents? Because I was going to buy us the, uh, those. Just go with it, dude. I'm not <laughs> thinking that hard. <laughs> Yay, I can move again. Yeah, Phoenix was going to get himself like a one-person tent. <laughs> All right, Simon is, uh, so I'm assuming that they got all the ingredients. Yeah. All right. Si Simon looks towards Hyacinth. How long do you think, it's a, how bad, how bad is it? How long do you think he has? It's pretty bad. He's starting to get delirious. Uh, I'm not why quite is, Why is this guy covered in leaves, dude? It's all right, Ronan. We are right here, and we're going to fix you up. Hyacinth looks over at Simon with a pleading look. Please hurry. I'm working on this. It's a uh, brewing oh, is not is not is not an exact science. It, this is we we did that we did this on ships because we had the time. Hand it over, Simon. Oh. Simon hands it. Uh, Simon very quickly hands it over to Pan. Pan basically plops the pot onto the fire and, like the professional she is, starts, um, she starts, um, quickly, um, cooking down and cultivating the rum. Yeah. It, si go ahead. Yeah, Simon is about to, si Simon opens his mouth to give some, to, 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 to give some suggestions, but then he... Looks at yeah, ca catches, catches himself an eye things, Pan. and he zips his mouth and steps back. Ronan, Ronan, stay with me. Stay with me. Don't go yet. Pumpernickel. Who's Pumpernickel? That that's he's getting more delirious. This is not good. Utu comes over to Ronan and kind of nuzzles against his hand almost sadly. Fuck, Bernico. Why you do me like this, baby bro? Baby bro? Hyacinth looks up. That's news to me. <clears throat> Tell me about the rabbits, George. Hyacinth raises an eyebrow at that one. <laughs> Hi, Hyacinth, I, I say, you're going to be okay, you're going to be okay with him. I want to, I, I want to take some of us and head over to, head over to town. See, like if we can't just bo boat over there and see if there's see a, what's going on and then come back. 
I'll be fine with him. As long as Pan is making the is making the rum, he will be okay. I don't think there's anyone more I trust right now to make that. All right. Get going. Figure out what's going on. Right. It's like si Simon. Simon. I'm calm. Si yeah, Simon speaks up. It's like, it's like, I'm going to. I'm going into town to try and find any sort of alcohol. It's a. Who's coming with me? I'm hey, coming. I, I, I'm with. I'm with you. We're the fastest there are. So. Thank you, choices. magical flying shark. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going. <laughs> Um, you guys. Okay, I'm gonna say y'all came over here just to make it a little less of a trek. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you hurry. Oh, take Nabbit. You guys are making me. So bad. <laughs> you guys hurry along the path. Why? Towards. Yeah, it's, um, and, uh, Ale Barrow. Yeah, before that, before they get, before they get in, it's like Simon says, "Wait a minute. Why didn't we just? Why have we never purchased horses?" I was thinking about that, but we moved too fast. What? And I and I am not. We are not having this conversation right now. Let's go get the bulls. Are they expensive? I don't care. <laughs> All right, so. Okay. Um, so re remind me who's there. It's um Simon, Raymond, and who else? Simon, Bata Raymond, and Bata, and Phoenix. Yeah, we took the fastest people we got. Mm 